set for the competition the next morning. While all of us, excited from the ceremony the previous night, made our way to the venue with our parents. I have no words because I'm very happy that I came here and I have now reached the finals. I'll give my best there now. We get to participate in thousands of competitions every year. But this is something different where we get to see so many people from different parts of India. Another exciting day began. We were told we were going to play a life-size chess. Wow! It looked amazing. The large pawns on the chess board were waiting when we arrived. The 20 of us were divided into four teams and we became king, queen, knight, bishop and rook. We were explained the rules. If you see an opponent in front of you, you have to ask these questions. And if he answers it correctly, then you're out of the game. But if you don't answer, uh, he doesn't answer it correctly, then he's, he or she is out of the game. Manchi Marathe King. Sombra Jalad Queen. Priya Gandhi Rook. Poonam Yada Bishop. Priyanka Chandrasekhar Knight. Go Green! A fierce game of real life chess began. We asked each other questions and students kept getting out. Who is the first person to discover the phenomenon of magnetic effect on electric current? Maxwell. Sorry. Give the chemical composition of sodium argento cyanide. The answer is uh, sodium. Then uh, argento is silver and cyanide. Uh, what is a coral made of? Uh, what did Gabriel Daniel Fahrenheit invented? Where does the stem get the minerals from? Which instrument is used to measure atmospheric pressure? Parents watched what we were up to from a distance and wondered what was going on. Which country discovered cloud seeding? Cloud seeding? Or USA? USA. That's the correct answer. Yes! More questions and eliminations followed. The winning team is obviously blue team. Congratulations! Yeah, the chest round was good. It was something like that Harry Potter one. Uh, we were given the crowns accord, uh, according to our positions and the pawns were, the pawns, the direction of the pawns was controlled by the king and uh, also ours won. The blue team won and fortunately I belong to that team. This is what he won yesterday. He was very happy. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Laptop le kar he was crazy. He said, Mommy, go to the hotel. We have to see what is going on. Which color I have got? I said, let's go. He didn't eat food. He opened it and then he went for dinner. He's absolutely thrilled. And till now, I will tell you, whatever we give them, they used to you know, want to show off to their friends. And I always used to tell him, that Jehan, don't show off. This is not something that you've earned. But yesterday, when he received his first laptop, it was I who said, Jehan, go off and show around, you know. This, this is what you have actually earned. While parents were still reading under the previous night's excitement, we went into our next round called SumoBot. We had to create remote controlled robots out of the material provided and then make them fight. A first for many of us. I am making the Deltron. I prefer to do the gyrator because uh, the gyrator cannot, uh, it cannot actually, uh, its defense is quite good but it's if, if attacking the attacking position is not that good. There were all the parts given and we have to just join them and uh, there were two kinds of robots we can make. I tried the easier one uh, and it worked. There was a sense of relief when it seemed to be working. Yes! Being a girl, she had dealt with Barbies, but not a robot or a remote control car even. So here, I, uh, it will be very good exposure for her to learn to handle that and to make it and to fight with it. I, mean, I don't know how she's going to manage. The strange ballet type movement of the robots was wonderful to watch. It was real fun to make them fight and for us to keep control and stick to our remote control rather than get into fighting ourselves. Some took a long time to finish the dancing and start fighting while others were clear winners. The last round was very interesting. We were provided with buckets and polythene to create air guns and it was called Air Zooka. We took a bucket over here and then we got a plastic bag, it's strong. 
and so we we have a ring over here and there are two plastic caps over here not like a cap they are plastic uh, circles uh, so we made a hole in between of them here we have taken the ropes and passed this to us right and so then when you pull this the energy stored in this comes out with force so. The strength of the air guns was tested over a row of candles. One partner aimed with the air gun while the other one guided him. The power of the gun was crucial in what was to follow in the round. A lot of us nearly made it. I couldn't do it. <laughs> But I tried my best. Girls are telling me doll see red. ऑसम like uh, it's in record like uh, he just uh, shoot it and on first chance he blew uh, he blew off uh, he nine. blew nine candles at a time then came the second part of the round we had to build castles out of thermocol and plastic glasses while the other teams had to blow them off with their air zookas each glass had different marks and we had to save them from getting blown away by trying to build them very steady but once the shooting started all the cars crumbled this round got everyone really excited it was physical a real game now one glass is left in now one glass good fabulous super i love the game it's really fun Finally, after a real hard day, it was time for the results once again. The student icons were going to be crowned. It had not been easy, but it had been a great day, and all of us had already won the laptops. More importantly, I think it has been a very interesting journey for all the kids here. Has it been a very good journey for all of you? Student Icon of the Year for Sanitfy. The ID is. And then the moment arrived. The four winners were declared. 522. Poonam Yadav. Shang Irani Sebastian Santi Kartikeyan Vasudevan He got a standing ovation. The others were disappointed, but they need not have been. They were great competitors and gave the winners a tough time. Cheers to the finalists and to the winners of Icon Scientifica Student Icons of 2009. And this is not it. Watch the next episode next week to find out what amazing opportunity the four winners got.